Hey guys, welcome to another Block Tech Tips. Here I have an issue where the laptop screen is not working as I'm about to turn on this machine. Now, as you can see here, you see the power and um, you might see hard drive activity LED, but the laptop screen remains um, blank. Now, all I want to do is flip over the laptop and you probably have an easy access hatch, something looking like this, maybe smaller or larger. Just remove all of the screws. Once you remove all of the screws, um, you're gonna open it up as I've seen here then you're gonna remove one of the RAM sticks if you have two um, if you have only one it's okay and then you wanna flip over and then power on back the computer now um, if for any reason you start to hear some beeps or so on it does simply means that one of the RAM sticks is dead and if you have only one you may want to actually get a second one but luckily you might have two as most laptops so all you have to actually do is actually um switch it out now soon as you leave one in you can power up and test if that one doesn't work either try the other one by switching it out to slot one or just simply try a second um new brand one that i've never been used before right and once you have gotten it correctly it should start up again so as you can see here despite the laptop screen was um, not showing anything right i'm not sure anything on display it's now working and you just press f1 in case you're seeing an error like this because this computer was just shut down without power up and you just press enter to continue and um, as you see here just running through the basic deleting um, some old data and as you can see here the windows is starting up all right so this is one of the main reasons why i've seen where a ram stick is bad luckily this laptop had two so all i had to do was just switch out one by removing it and then leaving the other one then sometimes what happens is that that one that you left in might be bad so if you didn't boot with the first one just simply go back again and actually try booting with the second one in so test one first then remove if that one doesn't work then remove it and then put in the other one one should work or just get a brand new one and test it all right as you can see here i'm now booting up to the um screen now the best thing about this is that most laptops can work with um uh, one um, of these RAM sticks you can actually buy a new one to replace the defective one that you saw there all right so as you can see here I booted up and the computer is actually working now all I have to do next in a case like this where um, it's just a defective RAM stick I just remove one and then basically I can close up I can actually screw up but the laptop so in about 50 percent of the cases you'll find that it was a bad RAM stick or a stick of RAM that was actually defective that needed to be removed if you have two um, if you have only one, you'll have to get a new one and actually test. You can even borrow one from out a friend's laptop. Alright guys, so um, next, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to ask you to do a second, try a second um, tip. Now if you're still getting that screen, you're going to actually remove the battery. And when you remove the battery, you're going to unplug it from the AC adapter. And when you remove it from the AC adapter, I want you to hold down the power button. So without a battery connected or it's been plugged in just hold down the power button for 60 seconds after you hold on the power button for 60 seconds simply put back in the battery reconnect the ac adapter and then try powering up in most cases it should work if it didn't work the first time attempt another two times before quitting now that will fix it for another um, set of cases that i've tried it can even work on desktops too last but not least if all else fails simply get a hdmi cable or a vga cable and simply take it and connect it to the display port or the display out of the laptop and connect it to the monitor now what should happen is that um, in some cases you'll notice the display on the monitor or the laptop sorry on the monitor should just pop up it indicates in this case that guess what you're having an issue where the display on the laptop is broken or the backlight in the display is broken and you're not actually seeing what's on the display so the display itself on the laptop is broken and all this has proved is that the laptop is actually working but you can't see it on the normal display and in this case you'll need to replace the day the screen all right guys another tip from block tech tips please check out the link in the description for a written version of this tutorial where you can get details and other videos and tech tips. Alright, this is Ricardo Gardner saying goodbye.